Hi folks, I'm Ryan Malone. I'm going to tell you today three things about me. How I came to know Jesus, what way he's changed my life, and how um, being a man of faith and a born again believer has helped me during this COVID-19 pandemic. First, uh, first of all, uh, I was raised um, under work salvation where I felt I need to do this and I need to do that to get to heaven. Um, I would have attended masses, uh, prayed the rosary, um, went to different novenas, went to, uh, prayed as much as I could and uh, tr basically tried my best to get to heaven. And I was walking up Royal Avenue one day in Belfast city centre and a man was preaching. I went over to him and spoke. And he said, are you a Christian son? I says, yes, I'm a Catholic. And we, we went back and forward doctrine. And he explained the gospel to me. You must be born again. And I'd never heard of this before. And we argued back and forward. Um, it was quite the fight in the faith, in that faith. Um, but deep down, I wasn't sure I was getting to heaven. Now, he said to me, Ryan, go home and read the Bible. Not out of a hateful way, but out of love and point me in the right direction. And he left me with Ephesians 2, 8 and 9, which is a scripture I could save through. For by grace he is saved through faith. It's not of works, lest any man should boast, but it's a gift of God. Um, and this struck with me. And I went home and for 15 months I read the whole Bible, cover to cover. And... And I phoned him, I says, Charlie, I was wrong, you got it right. Um, where Acts 16, 30 and 31, what shall I do to be saved? Believe in the Lord Jesus Christ and I shall be saved. It's not by our efforts, our works, by our faith in him. And their second point is, uh, what way has my life been changed? I think first of all, it's evident peace. Um, I mean... I think everybody's been at the stage where they're tossing and turning in bed at night worrying about death where they're maybe um, death struck hard or they're tossing and turning wondering where am I going to go well, after I take my last breath or after my heart stops beating but it's uh, clear that when we put our faith in the Lord Jesus Christ that we're saved we're sealed we're delivered um, there's nothing that can pluck us from his hand. And that uh, once we do believe that's it, we're saved. Not works or doing this or doing that or being a good person or even the sacraments won't get us there. So the peace, the joy. Um, and I was in, uh, working there and people said to me, Ran, how are you so joyful? And you know, it's the joy of the Lord. People see it through you. Reminds me of the childhood song, this little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. The Holy Ghost shines through you as a born again believer. And how's it helped me through this pandemic? That's a final point. How has believing in the Lord Jesus Christ to be saved helped me through this pandemic? Well, in many ways we see the death toll on TV. We see the hurt, we see the despair, we see uncertainty, we see panic. Um, fear, um, all these feelings that are normal human feelings, but through this whole pandemic, there's been a real sense of peace and understanding. And I, I knew we were going to pull through it, and I, I knew that um, although uh, death is a fearful thing to unbelievers, especially, that some believers might be fearful as well. Um, just a real sense of peace that even if I was to uh, die or to catch the pandemic or, or bits and pieces like that, that I know where I'm going. I am. So that's the greatest fear. Where do I go after I take that last breath? And folks, if you're outside Christ and you're watching this video, you have sinned. It says all have sinned. Even one lie leads to hell. Weeds to sin is death. Sin leads to hell. 
But you don't have to go there because Christ died on the cross, was buried and resurrected, paying the price for you on the cross. The blood of Christ cleanses us from all sin. He's, he's our atonement. He, he stands in our place. He took the punishment on the cross. And going back to Acts 16, 30 and 31, what shall I do to be saved? How do I get to heaven? Believe in the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. Thank you. God bless.